launch of a uh, rocket from Vandenberg Air Force Base, which will uh, launch a, uh, it's actually a Delta II rocket, and it's about to lift off. It is uh, holding what's called a Wide Field Infrared Survey uh, Satellite, or a WISE satellite, that's going to uh, launch into orbit. That's going to help them kind of track objects that uh, potentially pose a danger to Earth. Uh, this is uh, live from the website, from NASA TV, by the way, this morning. And this is a big launch from Vandenberg Air Force Base. The launch window opened at about 6.09 this morning, so about a minute ago. And it is only open until about 6.23. So the countdown is continuing. Uh, we're about at a 10-second mark. Seven, Let's join their six, audio here. Five, four, three, two, one. We have ignition and liftoff of a Delta II rocket and WISE. Searching for stars and galaxies never seen before. Good chamber pressure in both verniers and good chamber pressure in all three solids. Get 25 seconds. Mark 25 seconds into the flight. Bring nicely from the original uh, main engine uh, pitching yaw transients. Coming up 36 seconds, mark 36 seconds, vehicle now at Mach 1. Still looking good. 45 seconds in. Pressure beginning to decline on our solids. 50 seconds in, max Q, maximum dynamic pressure. Up on one minute into the flight, standing by for burnout. And we have burnout, burnout of the three engines, the three uh, ground-lit solids. We'll be holding on to those uh, solids for about 30 seconds to assure a good water impact point. One minute, 15 seconds in. And there you go. Successful, uh, for all intents and purposes right now, launch of a Delta II rocket from Vandenberg Air Force Base carrying a WISE satellite system. It was originally scheduled to launch on Friday but had to uh, be postponed due to weather issues. You saw that rocket go up through a layer of cloud cover this morning but then uh, back into the clear skies, as you can see. And, of course, they just said that they were going to hold on to those solid rocket boosters uh, so that they made sure that they were uh, contacting the water as opposed to the ground. And then uh, the second uh, dairy system will kick in. So there you go. There you have it. Wonderful to see that live this morning from Vandenberg Air Force Base.